Spaghetti High School students are on an early Thanksgiving break tonight, all because rumors and social media speculation disrupted class today. It is fallout from the fights that left nine students under arrest on Wednesday. Nia Wong is live tonight with more on what happened. Nia? Students were officially released at 1225 today, but because of a couple of rumors, parents began pulling their kids out of Rigetti High School as early as 11 this morning. Now, the school district says these rumors are unsubstantiated, but most people I've spoken with say they weren't going to risk it. Students at Rigetti High School were on their phones today trying to find out what was going on. He, I got a text from him saying that there's a rumor that someone had a gun. Nash says before texting his mom, he told a teacher. They didn't believe it. Miller says she came out to the campus to pick up her son as soon as she could. I don't know the whole situation. I'm just concerned about my son, so I just came and got him. Parents began lining up at the office administration building to check their kids out from school. Um, everybody's scared, you know, like they're calling their parents and just getting them out of school. Uh, yeah, it's scary. Two days after the riot that sent Rigetti High School into their second lockdown in a month, students say they feel uneasy. Like when I come out of class, I get really scared because I feel like something's going to happen and I might, you know, be in the middle of it. We're learning some new information from the Santa Barbara County District Attorney's Office. Right now they're pursuing six cases and the DA's office says if they do press charges, most likely those juveniles will not be charged as adults. Live in Santa Maria, Nia Wong, News Channel 3. Okay.